Welcome back to our channel. I am going to show you how to make some chicken salad wonton cups. And don't worry, this is very easy. So first one is you want to make sure that your muffin tins are well oiled so that the wonton wrappers won't stick to it. Place wrappers um, into each cavity. I used um, three this time because um, you want to make sure that it can support each other and also the chicken salad that we will be putting on it later. Hi, good evening! Today we are going to make um, some chicken wonton cups. Yep, that's right. It's very easy. All you need is some shredded chicken. I'm going to make a big batch tonight, so I need a lot of shredded chicken. And we have a cup of celery and a cup of yogurt. Um, in Japan, we don't have so much um, sour cream available, so I use yogurt instead. And also uh, mayonnaise. Uh, this is Japanese mayonnaise. Um, Parmesan cheese. And we also have... This is um, shiokushio. And this is salt and pepper. So, let's begin. First, you get the... A bowl. Okay. Let me put this here so you can see. It's so easy. You just have to um, kind of like mix them all together. And so first, of course, we put our chicken. This is um, a pre-boiled chicken. It's a cooked shredded chicken. salt already a little bit of salt but I'm not so happy with the salt so uh, the saltiness of it so I will add a little bit of salt and pepper before I put all the other ingredients and you want to mix it to make sure that all the other chicken can have more salt and pepper okay I guess that's enough and then you just um actually this um recipe you can add carrots if you like if you can add corn if you like you can add any um vegetable that you have um say let's say it's um like a leftover vegetables in your fridge and then first you want to add your mayonnaise okay okay this is your mayonnaise it's a cup of mayonnaise for three um, chicken breasts. Okay. Um, we can add more later if I, it, if I need to add more, but because I'm going to add yogurt, so 
I want to make sure that uh, it's not too wet okay and then I will add my yogurt yogurt the yogurt is so that your um, your sa your chicken salad doesn't taste like um, like mayonnaise like you know you don't want your salad to be tasting like mayonnaise only okay see see what I mean when I say that I don't want to add a lot of mayonnaise first because I know that the yogurt it's actually kind of like an extender too. <laughs> Um, I don't know, I just like the taste of yogurt and mayonnaise um, combined. Um, some recipes says you have to add Greek yogurt, but I don't know, maybe the yogurt in Japan is really good also. So um, yeah, I always just use a regular um, Japanese yogurt. Um, here. Let me show you how it looks like this one it's Meiji and it's 180 grams of yogurt there you go and then you add your celery your cup of celery I don't really like carrots so <laughs> I'm just adding um, celery just so that there is a crunch to the chicken salad dressing Then yeah, you're almost done. You just mix them all together. Okay. And my favorite part is a uh, parmesan cheese. I want to be generous with my parmesan cheese. Oops. It's actually new, so I have to open it. Hold on. I just um, put like maybe a quarter of it and then you mix it so the parmesan cheese will add flavor and a little bit of saltiness to it and yeah that's about it so maybe we can try how it tastes like oops I'm gonna try it if it's good enough and you know you can always add mayonnaise to your liking mmm mmm perfect I really like the the sweetness of the mayonnaise and this the tangy tanginess of the yogurt together and since um the party is tomorrow it's my birthday party and my friend's birthday party we are going to combine them so i don't want to do this tonight i just have to make sure that i'm ready for tomorrow and but i will show you how it looks like when we put them here in the wonton cups that you have baked for um, 15 minutes in 180 degrees Celsius. So I'm gonna get one. There you go. Isn't it so pretty? It's so easy. Like, you're going to be done in like, I don't know, in, I don't know, in 15, 20 minutes. It's really, really easy. I, um, maybe in total maybe 30 minutes so you just add a big scoop of your chicken salad and add here and you may add some, some parsley on top hmm. okay 
parsley to add a little bit of color you you may add um, a fresh parsley if you may but yeah I think this is really good and this is enough and and you see your and you can see this and it's a cup it holds by itself see and your guests will definitely be amazed and like they will say that oh wow this is so delicious and it looks really difficult to make but it's so easy without even frying the wonton cups you just bake it so that it's less oil and it's less mess you know and so yeah this is it and i hope that you um you learned something new i just got this from pinterest i will um add the link below or in the description box um, this is a very diff it's kind of like different from the the recipe the original recipe because I didn't add a lot of things but yeah um, the idea was from the um, the link from Pinterest that I got so yeah if you like it please um, don't forget to click the like button and um, share it to your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thank you very much for watching